if you have a student in your class that fails, are you looked down upon by other teachers? Oh, no. No? I mean, not that I know. Not to your face? I think some teachers think it's a badge of honor. To fail kids? Yes. Like old school. I like that. I remember there was like being at school yeah. and seeing kids that are doing right now. Yeah. This is like, I had this this is Italian boys in my class. Is this racist? No. Oh, okay. But like, it's a cultural. I asked the Italian kids, like, do you guys talk like this? That's racist. It probably was. <laughs> are, you ex are you excited for your students to see this? I think they, th I think it's fun and funny, but I'm always cautious that there's like me, the teacher, me, the person that knows you, me, the dad. And so I usually keep my worlds very separate. That's, it's hard though, as a teacher, you're like the most at risk. So let's, let's get the, let's get the teacher stuff out of the way. Don't snoop on my notes. I can't see anything in my eyes. Also, my hearing is not good, so. Your hearing is not good. That's awful. How old are you? Uh, 54. Did you forget? Did I what? On, I, no, no. It took you a while. No, no, no. Yeah. Because when I was young, are we supposed to look at this? No. When I was young, I played, <laughs> like if you have a problem and you're already 90% of the way to the problem being the worst, why? I'm just, I'm giving up. Is that a healthy way to look at it? It's an awful way to look at it. But I'm basically giving up on this and I need glasses. Fuck, man. You're not doing so great. <laughs> your eyes, your ears. Hair is losing. How are your knees? Bad. <laughs> I've gained 30 pounds in a year because I can't do really anything because my knee is shit. My knee is wrecked. You can swear. Yeah, but this is the example where but I worry that someone will take this clip. Okay, every, everybody knows when you're at home, you're saying the word no, shit. No, I don't. I don't swear at home. I don't think my kids have ever heard me swear in their lives. How old's your oldest? 26, but I don't swear at home. Nobody swears at home. If I ripped out an F-bomb, their mouths would just be like, really? Yeah. I'm not saying I'm righteous. We just never, I don't know, just never did it. Yeah, like I'm, I'm broken. I'm a broken parent. Like, what about your environment growing up? Oh, my mom never swore, but it made me, it made me want to swear so oh. bad. But then everybody made fun of me at school. Cause when I would swear, it was like, I was the kid who was like, yeah, man, like fucking shit fuck. <laughs> so what would your mom say? Like, oh, diddle spits. I don't even know what that is. Did she have, she must've said like, darn it. She called, I think she called my sister a bitch once. Oh no, no, that was me. That was me, sorry. Because you were my teacher in high school. I wanted to ask what your first impression of me was. Hmm. Unfiltered. Yeah. You were in a very long classroom that I had just moved into. I had no windows. Long. Right by the cafeteria. Yeah, it was like a door on one side door. Like physically long? Physically long. Okay. Yes. Um, I don't know why that matters, but you were quite... I don't know. I'm trying to bring up... Joking. It was very evident to me that you weren't trying to make comments to get attention from other people. That you were confident in who you were. Oh, wow. Yeah. And then, That's interesting to me because I feel like that's so opposite to who I am now. I don't agree. I, lately, I've been feeling so insecure. Okay, do you want to talk about this? <laughs> there was a kid in the class, and he was the opposite of you. I don't want to mention his name. And he would always do things to get approval, attention. And you didn't particularly like him. You, you could pick up that I didn't like him. Yes, this is weird, but the last time I saw him was literally like at the corner where the library was. This was a few years ago. I was here having coffee. I think my wife was doing something. Okay. Oh, she was in the library. Filming this show. Yeah. She's the next episode. But then when you got older, you seemed to step out a bit more. I don't know, you seem more gregarious in grade 12. Targaryen. Targaryen, did you say Targaryen? Yeah. Gregarious, like out there kind of. I was like, I was trying to, I was trying to connect me to Targaryen. Like, do you know how many times I have looked at um, the family tree of all the families on the Game of Thrones, and I still don't understand it. Is there like a is there like a Game of Thrones hierarchy yeah. when it comes to like teachers in the school? Oh, like school, like, is like Room like, of Thrones. Nobody fucks with this person. Yeah. Yes. If you, who would you be in Game of Thrones? Okay, I'll tell you. Who I don't want to be. Who? Uh, Bran. I don't want to fall off. 
off. Uh, I'll lose my legs. Or oh, 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 oh. I don't want to be him. You're also definitely not Cal Drago. You're, you're Ned Stark. That's... I'm not. <laughs> you, I'd like to be. Because you're very well respected. But I could also see you, like, getting killed off. Yes. Yeah. Oh, too nice. Yeah, yes. Do you have any, like... Do you have any, like, insane regrets? Besides having kids? Yes. <laughs> That's, uh... Did you ever... I have my license suspended twice, all for like oh. speeding, dangerous driving. And I feel like I put a lot of my friends at risk. I also, I get way more nervous making friends with a guy. I think for me, it's just because my dad was never around. So like, I already know how to communicate with a woman. Yeah. Like I know what to say, how to say it. But with a guy, I'm always like, yo dude, like, and we always, we, I always fuck this thing up every I time. I don't know how to do it. But I think it's like, like this. How are we doing this? Yeah. This way. Yeah. Holy shit, you got big hands. That's because I've gained weight. It's like, you go. Like that. Like that. What's that called? It's like dab, dabbing somebody up. Dab. Dabbing. T-A-P. D-A-B. B. Dabbing. Yeah. You know what you should do? What's that? Or the, where you go, like the dab or whatever. Yeah, that's a dab. Like it's like this or something. <laughs> Like a, a dab, a dab yeah. is this. Yeah, but that's different than this. Do it to another teacher. But I can do it to another teacher. Yo, dab me up. What about my kids? Yeah, yeah, try it. Yo, dab me up. Yep. What could I substitute? And say, also say it like, like you're almost insulted that they didn't do it. Like, yo, dab me up. But that, does that mean that I had to do something good previously? <laughs> like I made them a grilled cheese sandwich and they didn't say thank you. And I'm like, yo, damn me up. No. What do you bring for lunch at school? Okay, I've been teaching for 25-ish years. Yeah. And so I've probably brought, I'm gonna say 70 lunches in my whole teaching career. I almost never bring lunch. What did you do? I buy, it's, a, it's terrible. If I was to add up all the money I've spent at the cafeteria or leaving to go to Subway. I mean, it would be tens of thousands of dollars. You're, you're a Subway guy? Yeah. What's your order? Tuna, six inch. Tuna? Yeah. We talked about this before. I had so much respect for you. What do you get? Salami and cheese. Yeah. Do you remember how Subway used to cut their sandwiches? What do you call it again? Classic cut. Classic. Because you would go, they were trying to find like a shtick to be different than the other sub companies. So they would cut like a, like make a canoe out of the bread and then stuff the stuff in the canoe, put the top back on. And you were saying that you could still go and ask for this. You can try, but unless you get a, an employee that has knowledge. The classic cut. So if you, do you ever get a meatball? What I'm feeling freaky. But if you're getting something with sauce, it's perfect. It houses. Different word. <laughs> Holds. It was the perfect word. Okay. You were my geography teacher. Yeah. And my worst subject so, oh. is geography. Really? I don't know. Not, cities. That's not true. Provinces. States. That's not true. The other day someone said, we were talking about Spain. Yeah. And I thought Spain was a city. Mm. Is it? Wait, is it? But you know what? Is it? No. It's a country. I'm going to give you like an IQ test, but for like how relatable you are to your students. Okay. So the first one is going to be, it's called Who's That? I'm going to show you a bunch of people. Okay. And see if you know who they are. You don't have to show the camera. Uh, it's a Korean pop group, but I don't know their name. They're the equivalent of the boy BTS. Uh, okay. In my opinion. Their, their name is New Jeans. Say again. New Jeans. Do you like bell bottoms? Huh? Pant legs are getting really wide. And it reminds me of a nightmare that I went through in the 70s where like pants were so flared, bell bottoms. Oh, really? I hate the way jeans are going right now. If we're talking about, uh, hold on. Why'd you just change your voice? If we're talking about fashion sense in the 70s. Yeah. What are we breathing? <laughs> That's the 80s, but yeah. Oh, this is the 80s. I have to say, you look really good here. Really? Yeah, the hair, the suit. I was.
was very proud of that time. Uh, like, I'm gonna say, like, it's not Lizzo. <laughs> right? No. Didn't she just, isn't she like in a lawsuit right now? Who is it? Ice Spice. Really? Yeah. Is that like an homage to the Spice Girls? No. I don't know. She's How is she? She looks pretty cool. <laughs> I'm gonna say actress, actor. Is he one of the BTS guys? Wow. But he good job. Because he does look, but I thought he was an actor. Because it looks like a movie set. In the it's on his music video. Oh, uh, okay. His name's Jungkook. Some of them speak English. I like how you didn't even try to say the name. Yeah. Like, you think I should get this? Really? You, you, this is your reaction. Just give me a second. Okay. If you don't get this, this is you should be embarrassed. I'm thinking sports, but just hang on a second. Hang on a second. Mr. Allen. You can yeah, Google it. No, I'm not. I'm getting a call on my cell phone. Call me on my cell phone. <laughs> oh, it's terrible. Do you like Drake? When I hear his music, there's some things I find very catchy. Was he with Rihanna? He w he wishes he was. Okay. You have been talking to my sister. <laughs> do you I know it was a great, a great costume? Okay, that is her daughter's costume. You can see that it's meant for like a little person, like a kid. And so oh, I'm wearing it as an adult oh. costume. You can't say little person anymore. Okay. Um, Tyrion Lannister. What? Tyrion Lannister. Here, look at the picture and tell me if you know what happens next. Okay. Uh, you, what happens next is you don't go down there. Okay. Because I don't see an exit and that would make me nervous. But you don't, you've never seen that before? Oh, um, no. Is this like a part of my life again? <laughs> what? Is this like a part of my life? Dude, I don't know what that is. That's okay. It's a very popular like TikTok trend right now. This? Yep. People throw glass bottles down the stairs and watch them break. Okay. I don't even know what I'm looking at. Okay, the kid's gonna hit either the person on the chair yep. or what looks to be like I don't know if that's a vase or a drink or something. It's not set up. Like, it's real. So He's the kind of guy no. who would tell his mom to sit there no. and be like, oh, I'm gonna hit the drinks. But then hit her in the head. Okay, so this is, what does that mean? So this is, these are words that your students would know oh, the right, okay. Do you think you can use that in a sentence? Like, <laughs> like, uh, like you got Riz. Like, you know, you're tripping. Oh, like you're crazy. No, like you got style. Okay. That's pretty good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, do I do the dab first and then be <laughs> yes. like, yes, and then go, bro, you got Riz. Yeah. What am I saying? You would only use it in the context of like dating. Yeah. So maybe don't say it to a student. <laughs> that might be a like, what if they got like a good mark on a test? You wouldn't be like, you got Riz. You could, you could. Because that would be their relationship with the test. And you, you're thinking, that's Riz right there. That's oh, Riz. Oh, stop it. Have you ever seen this? No, I mean, it's gotta mean, it's gotta mean like, no problems, like Hakuna Matata. No. <laughs> No. Do you know what movie that is? Of course, yes, yeah. Let's say you really hate somebody, so you're thinking about them all the time. Yeah. They live in your head, rent-free. And you don't want them to. Like if somebody's talking a lot of shit about you, yeah. you would say, oh, I live in their head rent-free. Oh, I see. They're thinking about me all the time. Can a high school teacher guess what brand that is? <laughs> I 
Wow. Some, some people refer to it as double C. I got double, is it I got double C on Is that. it clothing? Yeah. Is it, is it uh, shoes? Like, for a place you're not supposed to make noise, why not do it after hours? I, I got caught in here, by the way, one time. What? You can't. <laughs> I like how he's trying to be quiet. Just use just enough. What'd you say? It's like a, a skater surfboard round. A skater surfboard? Like a board? It's not Billabong. Yeah, like Quicksilver. Will I even know the name? Do you want me to tell you? Yeah. Chanel. Come on, bro. That looks like the most common H&M scarf. What noise do you make when you're cold? Burr? Can stalk? <laughs> what do you, uh, what grows on a bush? Leaves, berries? Bear, 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 berry? <laughs> it's burberry. For this? No, I know you're not excited. No, it's fun. As I've said before, I can't see how there's anything really usable, but but that's why. Yeah, I know. That's why you are you are who you are. Sure. It's because you your self confidence is like so low. Or is that an act? No, it's not an act. It's there's things that I'm confident about, but I don't see this as one of the things because okay. Because if I just do it myself, it doesn't work. It works because you pluck. You know how to pluck the, the diamonds out of the, the ore. True. Because without that, it doesn't work. But without any diamonds to pluck, it's just dirt. 